I decided I was going to have to find a way as a civilian to do my part. When my children were younger and they used to go off to summer camp, I would put together care packages just with things that I knew would remind them of home and just let them know that I was thinking about them. So I thought, well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to send care packages to the troops. What can say home better than Girl Scout cookies? Gum, beer nuts, energy bars, things that they can just put in their pockets. Mouthwash, sunscreen, hand sanitizer, little stuffed animal, CD, Ultimate Fighting Championship DVD, Constitution of the United States. I didn't know who the hell she was. She says, hey, General Hurtling, uh, my name's Carolyn Blaychick. Uh, if you send me the name of all your soldiers, I'll send each one of them a personalized package. Very quickly got an email back from him and said, I don't think you quite know who I am. And he said, and I've got 37,000 soldiers here, so I don't really think that you want me sending you names. Immediately, a message came back as soon as I sent that email and said, General, I don't think you know who I am. If you send me all those 39,000 names, I'll get you 39,000 back in you. And she did. I mean, we, we've been doing 10, 11,000 a day. 3,000 packages in two hours. Every item that we include in our care packages is donated, and they're donated either by citizens from around the country who organize collection drives or by these corporate donors. This is from Boy Scout Troop 39 in Lancaster. This is uh, from Plainview, New York, Troy, Michigan, Texas. Tyler, Texas gets into the egg. For our 300,000th package, <coughs> we will be donating a 2008 Jeep Liberty. <laughs> We actually put the keys to it in one of these care packages and when they open it up, they'll find out they have a new car waiting for them when they get back home. Day, just know that there's somebody on the other side of the world that opened one of your packages and is more than thankful to get it. It's a good feeling, you know, someone's thinking about you and you see your name on that letter or that box and you're like, well, I do matter. And then when you personalize it with the name, you feel like even more connected to the people that actually put their hearts and mind and soul into that box. You're still being thought of. You're not in the forgotten war. People you know, protesting against you. There's still people out there that are, that are cheering you on and, and looking after us still. Hi, brave one. Warm California greetings to you from Dear a Hero, veteran back I want home. to thank you for having the strength and courage to fight for the freedom of our country. You make us you all proud are. to be Americans. You are the true heroes. All of us are Americans and we're proud to be and we want to do what we can for our country. This is providing a way. It's giving them a way to say thank you to our troops. People come here and at the end of the day, but they know they've accomplished something really important. America, America, God shed his grace on me. Uh, thank you for all the packages y'all considered and thanks for all your support. With thank you for all the care packages. God bless you. Thank you. Just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. Sing.